afternoon. All getting on guys and welcome back to the channel. My name's Rob and this is Fen Farming. Now then, Dad is drilling some sugar beet today. Here's some clips of him doing that. I took on my iPhone, so amateur footage. He's drilling that field and then we're waiting to come back over on this black fen soil. Uh, we're waiting for the barley just to come up a little bit before we drill the sugar beet on them other two fields. But nevertheless, I want to apologise about the last video because I sort of... Always someone rings me. Anyway, what I was trying to say was... Uh, I'm Jet, and it's the warmest it's been ever while I've been jetting. I'm in a t-shirt. Uh, yeah, been real nice last couple of days. So Dad's got on with some spraying, and now he's drilling the sugar beet. Well, one field, anyways. Like I said, um, tomorrow it's meant to be all right, but the next day, Wednesday, when this video is out. Or it might be Saturday, it's going to rain and not look very good for the rest of the week. Uh, tomorrow should be a more exciting day. I'll mix that in with this one. Uh, we've got to put fertilizer again on the winter wheats and the winter barley. So got to be flat out before the rain hits the following day so you'll rejoin me tomorrow let's hope with the fertilizer spreader on fertilizer spreader calibrated up spreading some more white gold today not that I do getting a good old tad out here now I'll, um, I'll try and get over and see dad when he's drilling the other couple of fields of beet might be in a week or two's time for the 6-6 uh, with some drone footage because that'll be good to see while before that dries up so I can go fertiliser spreading. Morning anyway. Sit rep. It's the next day now. And I didn't get fertiliser spreading because all day it was like this. All just sort of miserable and foggy, damp. Um, and yeah, we decided not to go spreading so we did a few jobs around the yard that no one sees so we went over to farm two and put a water pipe in to the water tank there um, so that can just fill up on its own when it gets down when dad's spraying over there so he ain't got to come all the way back here and refill up with water and then we did a few more jobs in the yard 
um, in the new bit where the new bit of concrete is. But today we're down at mine. We are, well, we did start a couple of weeks back and everything's been put on hold because we've been drilling this, that, and the other. But converting my garage. So, might have filmed a bit of that today. But uh, yeah, if you're interested or not, keep watching. Uh, and also, there's a special bit at the end of this video as well. So, if you make it that far, drop a like and drop a comment. If you want to see what happens when two farmers turn into two builders, and look what two farmers can do when they turn into two builders, I'll show you later on. Hello, and welcome to DIY SOS with me, Nick. No, I'm only joking. I'm only joking. I am not Nick Knowles, but anyway, this is what we're up to. Um, we are converting the garage into a gym, a room, a gym, a gym, a gym. I know what you're thinking, you don't need a gym. Well, I like something to do and yeah, that is something to do. But I'll put some pictures up of, if I've got some, of before and what it looks like now. Me and dad have done most of it ourselves. Well, we've done all of it ourselves. The only thing we won't do is dot and dab the walls with plasterboard, but I know a man who can. Um, so we've even done the wiring ourselves. Um, and yeah, we've screwed the plasterboard on the roof, on the ceiling, and we've made that stud wall in there and we're just making another stud wall in here and this is going to have cladding cladding on it as well uh, that I picked up the other day um, yeah you probably think oh you're a man of many talents no I am not a man of many talents my dad is a man of many talents I'm just a bloke who makes the coffee and passes him a screw or a hammer um, yeah. <laughs> anyway, uh, we've got to a stage now where we're going to build another frame inside, inside here. Windows on the trailer. Windows going to go in there, and then we've got to put some membrane on. Cut the membrane out for where the window's going to go. Put insulation in. Cut all the rock walling on the trailer. Insulation's going in. But yeah, that does look different. That does look different. That's going to change the front of this building by far.